Dave's Bruce Kleps Garage. This is uh, Parking Lot Find Tuesday. Um, oldest son Ted was on Facebook of all places, found a car for sale at a used car lot, and uh, we're going down right now to to try to to bag it. It's uh, it's a really rare find. We'll show you here in the next clip or two what we found, but it's uh, it's a very rare car. It's like one of 500 ever built. And uh, it's sitting outside in a used car lot. It's like, oh, we gotta go check this out. So here we are on the road. So we're driving down through here and uh, there's this used car dealer. And he's got this car advertised. Oh my, well this looks like a real place. And we're gonna see if we can find this car. Don't see it yet. Oh, I'm get out of here. Oh yeah, Man, just zoom over here. Look at this, look at this. 57 El Dorado Bro, sitting in a used car lot. So here it is, a 57 El Dorado Bro. Very few of these made. Barn fine condition. This thing's just cool. This has even got little knobs to tell you where to set things at. And uh, little red and green gauges there. You got your window controls, mirror control. Looks like that needs a little help. Door opening thing. It's only showing uh, 49,000 original miles. It's missing the uh, vanity box though. And the uh, the whiskey decanters. <clears throat> hmm. You gotta have that when you're driving a car. Suicide door. Just cool. Stainless steel top. Top of the line for 57. Car cost between 12 and 13 grand new. Had the exhaust down in the bumper. Come out there on both sides. Fuel door. Check out the fuel door. This is cool. I always like to hide them things. There's your fuel door. A old Dorado. Rare, rare, rare. Sitting in a car dealer. The only major thing I see here is a dent right there. This is unbelievable. Unbelievable. Just sitting outside. So I just talked to the dealer about the 57 Caddy. Uh, apparently, he's got a friend, older gentleman. Uh, the used car dealer is older too, but this guy must be older. And uh, he moved into a retirement village and he must have sold his house. And, and there was a couple cars in his garage. And this Caddy was one of them. So his friend, the car dealer, hauled him to his lot and was going to try to sell him for him. And apparently there's an issue whether the guy actually wants to sell him or not. Uh, the, uh, the car dealer says make an offer. So I made a, a legitimate offer of several thousand dollars, uh, a good offer. And as I was making my offer, the, uh, the associate comes out and says, Hey, we just got an offer from Australia. It was about five grand more than what I offered. And I'm like, well, you know, that guy's in Australia. And um, I'm here, and I have the cash, so uh, I give it to you right now. So that didn't uh, seem to help. He says I got to call the guy, run it by him. I'm like okay, so here's my card. Call me. I said I'd like the car. So we'll see what happens. Well, it's been two days since we found the caddy. Uh, yesterday I tried calling the dealer twice. The call wouldn't go through. I'm thinking, well, maybe he. Um, disconnected his phone the ad was taken off the Facebook um, ad like I don't know it was only up for like 20 hours so that went down and uh, they weren't taking the calls so this is the second day I got a hold of him today and I said what about the caddy I said like buy the caddy anyhow uh, the car dealer informed me that the gentleman that owned the car who's now residing in the rest home says he has sold it and he sold it for uh, uh, a lot of money 
And uh, so I'm thinking, well, unlikely because I looked the car over and it wasn't worth as much money as they supposedly got out of it, which was, was good money. Uh, but anyhow, we'll see. The guy's going to keep my card, and he said if the deal falls through, he'll call me. So I'm going to keep the trailer hooked up to the truck. Not really. But anyhow, uh, you know, it's not that big of a deal because, well, like, um, I have a, a suicide car right now. Let's see if I can flip this. Hmm. Well, stand by. Yeah, so I have a suicide door Lincoln right now. It's a 61. About the same shape as that Caddy. Actually better. It runs and drives. So let's just check this out real quick. Yeah, so here's a 61 Lincoln suicide door car. It's got like 120,000 miles on it. Little mouse hole there. But it is the old suicide door Lincoln. Maybe it might be missing the back seat. But still, it's a Lincoln. You know, Camelot, Kennedy, all the good stuff. We'll just fire this thing up and take it for a drive. Because unlike that Cadillac, this one actually runs. Look at the stylish front end on this thing. That's just cool. got old Lincolnstein running. I've brought this car back from the dead at least twice. It just keeps running. Doesn't know when to quit. Let's take it for a little drive. I got a truck in my way. Yeah.